Okay, you guys, guess what? I just made this entire meal uh, thinking it was recording, and it wasn't. This is what I just made. I don't know if this is, I mean, as I already said, which I probably didn't capture in video, I was making this Waitrose Douchey Douchey Organic Waitrose Douchey Organic Richly Fruited Christ Christmas Pudding. In England, where I am right now, pudding is dessert, so this is what it turned out as. And I just cut into it, so it was just round before. Um, yeah, I don't know what to think either. Uh, it was in this, and I was steaming it on the stove, which it says to do, like, in this container with the top actually on it. And then I saw that it was going to take an hour. Before I saw that, I saw that you could microwave it. I, I decided to microwave it, which I did. So, it's basically heated up fruit cake, kind of. It's not even really cake. It's, it's so not bready. Like, the only ingredients besides fruit, really, you know, sugar, obviously, salt, um, like, juices, but wheat flour is pretty much the only non, like, fruit-based ingredient. So... Yeah, okay, I got a plate. And we're gonna figure this out. You dismiss the whole thing. That's okay. It, I still experienced it, so one of us is is doing okay. And it's me, because I'm gonna eat it anyway. So. Thought this was gonna be one of my first videos. Uh, I mean, it is going to be, this This video is going to be one of my first videos, but obviously, me going through the motions of making this uh, douchey organic <laughs> fruitcake, which smells, um, I don't know if I captured it or not, it smells kind of like a bagel, like a cinnamon raisin bagel, and if you look at it, it's essentially heated up like raisins and other sh stuff. I know, it's terrible lighting, I know. Let's keep trying, world. Never give up. I'm also dog sitting right now. So I've never used that kitchen before. And there is the little being. The little angel. Sleeping like a... Like an angel. Okay. There is a one light in here, so possibly better lighting. Okay. So. Well, my first bite was like a crunch. Kind of like a, if you're eating raspberries and you get a raspberry seed stuck in your mouth. I'm so unsure what this is supposed to be. I mean, it tastes okay. It tastes a lot like raisins, which aren't like my favorite thing in the world. But before opening up the container, I actually didn't know what this looked like. Like I microwaved it with just a punctured top, like the instructions said. But before that, I had not seen this thing. And it looks just like a big pile of raisins, essentially. That bite was pretty good. It had like a little bit more bready breadiness in it. And it's not bad. Hmm. And that bite I tasted a little bit more of the orange peel. That's like one of the last ingredients. 
There's orange peel and lemon peel at the very end of the ingredient list. So, I mean, there's not very much, but I'm still tasting them, which I like. I don't know. It's like, it's almost like a polenta cake. It's really thick and moist. Obviously, because it's full of fruit. Glorified warmed up raisins is what this is, essentially. It's got another seed of some kind. All right. I don't know what else to say about that. That's essentially it. Um. Review of Waitrose Ducci and or Ducci Organic Christmas Pudding. Um, right now it's like a 5 out of 10. It doesn't taste bad. It's really easy to make. I just legit, I legitimately just threw it in the microwave for 3 minutes and then it was done. Before that I tried steaming it. I don't even have a steamer. The people who own the house, own the flat, um, they didn't leave almost any kitchen utensils out, so it took me a while to find even plates. I found like two plates that they had left for me, which is very nice of them. But um, yeah, this is, it's okay. It tastes like fruit. Like some of the more cakey parts with them. Um, more of the like sugar and juice infusions in them taste good. So it's all right. But uh, yeah, that's basically it. Um, thanks for watching.